Hey guys, welcome back to Let's Play Sam Max, episode 103, The Mole, The Meatball, and The Mafia. I and thought we were doing funny name gags after the first one. Oh, were we? Oh. Eh, we can continue it in the next episode. That's I guess fine. We can. So, as you can tell, Trance is here, and I'm nigh as usual. At some point, I should probably not be nigh, just to throw things up. Anyways. You should be Batman! Not everybody's Batman, apparently. Well, if there's yeah, one thing I have learned by being on the internet, it's that everybody's Batman. And if there's two things I've learned on the internet, is that my mom has slept with 90% of the world's population. Okay, let's talk to Sybil and learn how she witnesses Hello, things. Hello, Sam. Hello, Max. Hey, it's our Please, for the love of God, do not be a Jehovah's Witness. This time, I found the job for me. I've become a ah, professional, professional trial witness. witness. Okay, my heart is actually beating again. Okay, well, you know, we have it's to ask her. Dumber. We have to ask her. Does the carpet match Does the drapes? The carpet match the drapes. Interior decorating was like eight months ago. I'm a trial witness now. That and makes complete sense. Right over her head. Right, just, just, yeah. Like a dying albatross. In the middle of a theater show. If you get that, please leave a comment in the comments. Anyways, uh, so uh, what's a professional trial witness? What exactly is a professional trial witness? I don't oh, know you can do this as a profession. Great. We give dramatic testimonies, sequester in ritzy hotels, I mean, and order room you'd service have to, in the name of truth and justice. I mean, it almost sounds like you're enriching yourself to be a professional trial system. witness. Do you have a problem with that, Mr. Freelance Police? It's a mockery. Yeah, why didn't we? Then again, they are freelance police, so I guess we should just. Why'd you become what a professional you trial witness? To a professional Maybe witness. she'll actually Publishing illuminate us. Publishing the Alien Love Triangle Times taught me a lot about the truth, you know. That you don't That's have no, any of it. Get... Out there? <laughs> that there isn't any. And then you one shit! Day I got called for jury duty, and the rest is history. No, that's not how you tell a goddamn story. When you're telling a story, it is your job to tell me what the history was, not to just say, "Bam." Well, you see, when a man loves a chicken, anyway. Now, I'm reminded of some comedian who said that you know, if you do the rest is history, all you have to say is. One day, Hitler got kicked out of art school, and the rest is history. There were yeah. intermediate steps. Things yeah. happened. No, you can go for... One day, amino acids, and the and rest <laughs> is... One day, amino acids, and then we dropped a nuke on Japan. Uh, a big bang, rest is history. Yeah, pretty much. I mean, that's, that, that's, that's what is, that is. I don't subscribe in that. No, I, I mean my parents. Okay, we're moving on from that as fast as possible. What's your next it's career going to be, Sybil? What's your next career going to be? Oh, there is no next there career. There is no next I'm career. With trial she is for good. Sybil. We have seen her in at least three different careers in three different games, and I'm expecting it's a running gag that's going to continue, but Sybil believes this is going to be her final career. Keep in mind, she has the detritus of her old careers around the office. It's only a decoration. Seriously. So, uh, what is your next career? No, seriously, any ideas about your next cockamamie? You gotta be profession? thinking about something. I resent that. Of course, you resent that. Okay, so what's your first case? Do you have your first case yet? Maybe it'll give me no, a clue. No, but I'm waiting for a call from the district attorney. He says he's got something I'd be perfect the for. The DA is actually playing you along with this. You feel getting a case first and then being a witness for it? Not She's gonna all. witness the All's case the after the after the trial. That crimes are witnessed by someone who's unprepared. Doesn't even make sense. Happen. Or who doesn't have I mean, she has a point, though. Skills to accurately remember or relate what happened. She, she really does have a point. My background and widely varied oh? skill set. The I'm witnesses perfect. you normally see in trials are that just not prepared sense. to actually be a witness. Should I be afraid? Yeah. Probably. Like, they weren't concentrating enough when the crime happened to really notice anything. So I'm kind of curious. Is trial witnessing Isn't dangerous trial in some way? A trifle dangerous? Oh, no. Uh, We're protected Are by you, like, truth. actually asking that to me, or is that a thing in the game? That because was a thing I in the game. We'll distracted. Back, ah, and apparently Sybil does not believe it's uh, dangerous at all. Okie dokie. Yes, yes, it can get you killed. Yeah, that was foreshadowing. Mm hmm. Okay. How much aft shadowing? Hmm. No, no, no. We don't do that here. Okay, oh, shadow jump from Soto. Might. So you know we what I mean. go to. 
I I'm a lover of puns, but this one is just too bad, so I'm skipping it. Teddy Bears Mafia Free Playland and Casino. Don't worry, Sam will say it for me. I that missed was just... it. It's a lag pocket. Teddy Bears. Ted E. Bears. Mafia Free Playland and Casino. Welcome to Teddy Bears Mafia Free Playland and Casino. Okay. Ted. Ah! Initial E. Last name Bear. Name's it's not Bear. even really a good Boy, pun. It's just kind of generic. It's one of their Bear. weaker ones, Take honestly, which is probably the intent. Yeah, I'm sure it's made that on purpose. Saying, Welcome. And go spend a lot of money. So this is basically Chuck E. Cheese for Mafia Men. Well, it's a front, but yeah. You look Holy really domesticated familiar. Ursons, Max. Lovey Bear here's got the same head as that hypnotic teddy bear. Did you notice Irish Mr. Evil look you in the think background? That little talk show bear had a litter of giant babies? No, but I noticed a I glitch know, Max. in my uh, stream, stream causing Max's head to briefly fill the screen in a most horrifying fashion. Oh god, I wish we were recording that. Him and get to the bottom of this. It's like this mask half rabbit, holes, half showdown, all crime against existence. Right in front of me. What? Sorry, I wasn't listening. I, I, I do love that comment that the Mafia guy just made. <laughs> Sam Max just sat there and talked about their mission and about what they know and the fact there's a mole here. And the Mafia guy just goes, Okay, you two are idiots. And it's a good thing this mask doesn't have ear holes or I may have heard that entire conversation. I don't think we need to talk to this guy anymore. Thanks, Lovey Bear. Enjoy, and remember, if you're not losing, we're not winning. I do love that he's wearing... He, he, he even has the... He even has the hat. Yeah. So we need to play Whack to Rats. It's a beloved carnival game with a delightful mobster twist. Wow. What better yep. way to relax than by... And you use your actual gun, if I remember correctly. Imaginable. No, please supply your own firearm. Yep, arm. please supply your own firearm. We arm. always do. So, I actually do have to play this. Uh, I can't remember how hard it is. So, token, use on Whack to Rats. And Sam makes a pun. If the rat's keeping his mouth shut, you don't touch him. But if he's singing, you put a bullet in his head. Sounds right about right. How can we not? But yeah, I actually That's... have to play this. That's... It's not too hard, honestly. Yeah, it's just so dumb. Whoops. Yeah, it's just a complete genre shift. Luckily, all you have to do is hit to, uh, 20 and you win. My high school guidance but you actually do have to win that. I should have become a mafia hitman. Look, wow. Yeah. So what did we get? Ah, right. The teddy bear refrigerator magnet. I remember what you used that for. Hey, let's find someone with a metal plate in their skull and redecorate their forehead. Can we? Can we please? Is that something we're actually allowed to do? Right side of everything, don't you? I really hope we can do that. Now let's go shoot something. They don't actually put magnetic metal in people's heads, do they? Uh, it depends. They used to, but it's not common anymore. It can cause interference and resonation and whatnot, and that'll fry you good. Uh, that said. You can, uh, you can get implants and whatnot. In fact, uh, there's an interesting surgery that you can get done where they split open your fingertips and a little carefully sealed capsule containing a powerful rare earth magnet. It's very small, not big enough to pick things up, but because of how sensitive and nerve dense your fingertips are and how magnetically sensitive rare earth magnets are, you, well, basically get another sense, the ability to feel magnetic fields, which is really freaking cool and really freaking freaky. I want that rubber ducky. ducky ashtray. Am I allowed Leave to keep it? To it? The toy mafia to make smoking fun. Nope. Okay. So the question is, do I want to do this the right way or do I want to do this the wrong way? Ah, uh, do this the left way. That sounds Looks about right. Tasty. The original teddy bear. Because there's this there's a specific way to do this, but if you do it the right way, you skip like half the episode. I think something like that. It's a pretty extensive amount of time. Oh well, it's something we can think about between episodes because this one is done, guys. If you want to tell us exactly how we should spend the money that we're inevitably going to win in this casino, do leave a comment in the comment section. And if you like this episode and want me to do some more of them do hit the like button. 
And if you want to know when I actually do them, regardless of the fact if you hit like it or not, please hit subscribe. And me and Trance will see you later. Don't get your dick caught in a cactus.